Hi, this is Matt Young, teaching professional at Hagen Oaks. Today we're going to talk about club selection around the green when you're chipping. Most people will get in the habit of always using their sand wedge or a club with a lot of loft around the green. Unless you have something that you need to carry, how about we try something different? Now, a sand wedge, yes, it's not a bad idea. When you get around the green and you have a lot of room to work with and you can get the ball rolling early, I like to take something with a little less loft. A sand wedge, you're going to have to get hit a nice clean shot, get it up in the air, and sometimes it's hard to predict the kind of roll you'll get out of it. So why not take something like maybe a 7 iron, or even when you're this close to the green and you only have to go through the fringe, a putter. With this kind of stroke, all you have to do with this 7 iron is make your putting stroke, keeping the club nice and low to the ground, get the ball rolling, and it'll be a lot more consistent. Usually a club with this amount of loft or your putter the misses will be a lot uh, closer in dispersion than something like a sand wedge. There I took a nice short slow swing, got the ball rolling and ended up really close to the hole. Try this tip next time you're out on the golf course.